video is brought to you by Squarespace. So Funky Friday is finally updated for the first time in almost over a month once again. This time we do have week 7 as well as versus Void and a ton of new animations with some new note splash mechanics. Now yes, I am going to be very late for this update showcase, I've been very busy in real life, but let's jump right into it, smash like, subscribe, and let's see what we got. But before we check out the update, I do want to go over today's sponsor of the video. So what exactly is Squarespace? It's the all-in-one platform for building your brand and growing your business online. I mean, imagine if Tricky wanted to sell and brand his cookies. He could use Squarespace to make it all possible. There are many features that Squarespace offers that could help Tricky with his business, such as custom template optimizations that has designs to fit his needs, emmed videos where Tricky can showcase his baking skills at work, and also analytics in order to help grow his newly founded business in the process. So head over to squarespace.com for a free trial, and if you're ready to try it out, make sure you go to squarespace.com slash captainjackattack to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Links in the description, and once again, a huge thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. We are going to go over the Tank Man animation first for 650 points. And this is what this looks like on idle, it's finally in the game, left, down, up, and then right as well. Very nice, honestly. I mean, hey, it took them about a year at this point to add the animation in and they finally done it, man. I mean, sometimes it takes some animations a long time, you know. Our next one's gonna be Dark Sonic for 700 points as well. This is what Dark Sonic looks like on idle. Pretty interesting, actually. Left, down, up, and then right as well. That up pose do be looking pretty nice. Again, pretty basic, but they do have some pretty cool movement mechanics within it. Next up, we do got Super Sonic for as well 700 points. This time we got a floating one on idle, left, down, up, and then right as well. I like this one a lot. That one actually looks really cool. Definitely one of the better animations in this update thus far. For 700 points, you cannot go wrong. Next up, we also do got the Void animation by Tired TV for 700 points once again. This is what the new Void animation looks like on idle, left, down, up, and then right as well. Very cool one once again. It's another floating one. Now this one can be a little bit glitchy with your hand depending on which avatar model you go with, but it is pretty cool nonetheless. And this time we got the all consuming version of the void animation for an extra 100 points. And this is what this version looks like on idle, even cooler with the floating microphone, left, down, up, and then right as well. Dang dude, some flashy moves. I mean, it just takes the void animation and it steps it up even further. And then last but not least, the boy and girl animation from week 7 for 1,150 points. And this is what this animation looks like on idle. It's going to be customizable with an ID, left, down, up, and then right as well. Hey! I mean, it works, man. It works! Honestly, I was a little bit surprised that they finally added this in, especially with the whole like boyfriend girlfriend rule on Roblox. They still managed to add this animation into the game. Oh, I guess we do have the minus Garcel animation, but I forgot that it was a brand new one. So here we go. So this is what the minus Garcel animation looks like on idle. Those are some pretty crazy wings, not gonna lie. Left, down, up, and then right as well. They light up with the arrow colors. That is pretty crazy right there. Honestly, definitely the best animation from the update. Like, hands down, 3D modeled wings, what more could you ask for? So, as for new features, it did add in these note splash effects that does go on while you're playing. You can actually toggle them within the settings via the toggle note effects toggle. And along with that, they did add in a new background as well, the Unstable Stadium. We did see this in the leak video that we, well, 
forgot to cover. <laughs> Honestly, I was on like a mini vacation, so I, did, I wasn't able to cover the League video, but this was from the League video, and honestly, it does look really cool too. But yeah, it's pretty much it for all the new features. Let's go check out some of these songs against the bot. So obviously, they already have Week 7 added into the game. I'm pretty sure all of you guys know how Week 7 goes like, so we're not going to play that. We're going to play some of the new songs that a lot of you guys probably have not heard of. All right, here we go. Heist test by the Dimensional Sonic Funkin' Team. This is one mod that I've actually never even heard of or even played to be honest, so this one's gonna be very different. And of course, we're going up against two mango poles. We got the bot mango pole on the left side, and then we're holding another mango pole right in our hands too. I mean, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, this Funky Friday update is pretty good. Animation wise, you guys got a lot of new animations to choose from, but mods wise, it looks like they've only added in one or two mods that are like brand new to the game and not updated as well. So I would like to see more of a balanced update in the future with like the same amount of animations but also replicate it with the same amount of mods as well. I think that would be perfect. And also this song's not too bad too. You kind of grow an acquired taste for it, you know what I mean? It's pretty slow, this one in particular, but I feel like some of the other songs from the mod can be a lot more difficult. Oh, this one can looks like it does oh okay never mind it looks like it's starting to pick it up a little bit right here all right here we go it just needed some time ladies and gentlemen honestly some of these songs they kind of go pretty slow in the beginning in order to throw you off and then later on in the song like randomly out of nowhere it just starts to pick up so fast to the point where you're not even like expecting it like this part right here like what the heck that part is actually really insane! Mapping wise too, that's crazy. Very, very enjoyable though, and also very interesting key mappings at certain parts of the song too. It's actually really crazy, man. I like this one. Unilluminated is gonna be the next song. This one's gonna be pretty insane. Oh jeez, what the heck is this big? What is that? What? Yo, what is even going on right here? What is with the charting in the song, bro? This is freaking ridiculous, dude. Dude, I don't even know if Silly Fan's able to even play this song, too, man. But apparently, we're getting some sections down. I mean, just don't look at my 11 misses and counting, you know what I mean? But hey, man. This is definitely a song for the pros. Unluminated on Insane? I want to see how many of you guys are going to be able to full combo this song. Like, hands down, I bet none of you guys are going to be able to full combo this song. I mean, look at the bot, bro. The bot's going off right here. My turn. Let's see how we do right here. Oh, man. This part is like the craziest song I've done in a while, man. Honestly, this has got to be like the craziest song that I've played in quite a while, to be honest. And I haven't really been playing Funky Friday, to be honest. But, man, this definitely like breaks my fingers, bro. No cap. Like, ow. But yeah, guys, pretty good update. Would like to see more mods being added in the game. Make sure you guys go check out Squarespace. Link in the description and pinned comment. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content on the channel pretty soon. We'll see you guys on the next one.